Ah, round table. Um, wanted to search for maybe some armor or something I can buy. Where was that person who was selling armor? Was it down here? Wait, I don't think I actually went down here before, did I? Okay, I guess I can't go in there. That's frustrating. I probably can't open this door either. Yeah. I don't even know why I bothered. Who the hell was that person? Here. No, it's you. Uh, what do you need? Oh, wait, I did. Oh, are you aggrieved? Then you would do well to remember. Stand before the Elden Ring if those words held any meaning to you. Follow the guidance of Grace. Lay low the shard bearers and claim. Do so, and then you will receive. No. Well, I thought he was a different NPC. When I started speaking to him, I realized that he was the guy from the beginning. Oh, this is the Edge Lord. That people said. Ah, yeah, here we go. Alright. What is that? So, I have a rapier already. I think a long sword would be handy. Is that a better bow? No, it's not. But I really do want to get better armor. So three, six, what's this? Finger seal. I, I, I don't, I don't know what a finger seal does. What's the point? That's a hundred percent physical damage negation. So I'm buying that for sure. And I don't have enough souls. So let's use, you know, fuck it. Let's use them all. all right, that's enough for the, let's use one of these. Really? A, a lot? It's 2,000? Alright. Did I already buy the boots? No, I mustn't have. Okay. The gloves and boots first. Oops, that's not it. We'll increase my weight, so... I Probably won't be able to roll as fast. Oh, I'm so bad at this menu. Alright. And I'll buy the legs. I'll just use them all. What is this? Oh, right. Oh. Alright, you have the legs. Okay. Well, I'll buy this then. I probably will start mid mid rolling now yeah there we go <laughs> get the mullet out <laughs> um was there an npc that i could sell stuff at i'm so lost Level up twice, so... No, I'm gonna do endurance once. I 
I, I don't... Oh, maybe I should use these, huh? What does this do again? Oh. Oh! So maybe I should go see the blacksmith really quickly. Oops, he's not here. Is he up there? Nope, I think he's this way, right? Yeah, there he is. Well, I took you for no matter. Lay out your arm. Right, strength and armament. What? Can't strengthen it? Why not? I don't have smithing stones. What if I sell? What can I sell to him? No, 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 no. no. I'll sell this piece of shit shield. And the mark. Oh, no, I won't sell the mask. Bandit Gub, actually. Oh man, 200? Oof, shouldn't have bought them. I will sell the... the. Hang on. All, all around the defenses are way better. Oh, that's immune. No, wait. The immunity's huge on those. Alright, so I guess when I go into like a swamp or some shit like that. I'll wear the bandit gear. Um, if I take this off and this off, do I start rolling better? Yeah, I do. Alright, what if I put the bow back on? I still roll better, so it's just the dagger that's sort of weighing me down. Alright, uh, what am I doing? None of that. Let's... This is pointing me this way. I assume I haven't found where I need to go. So I might go back here and then make my way forward. I'm not exactly sure where to go or what to do. Like they said find the castle. What fucking castle? There's like 10 of them. Follow the, the lines. Okay, so the castle's like got to be over here somewhere. Wait, why did I go up here? I can't. I got to fucking jump down the mountains again. I'll go here. Alright, where are you pointing me? Literally nowhere. Is that a castle? Am I heading in the right direction? No. Church. Do I have to go there? Maybe I could try the catacomb. Oh, well, I haven't really become stronger. Alright, whatever. Let's go here. Where am I? I'm not finding maps. I gotta... What is that? It's like a giant bell on legs. What the fuck? I don't know. I feel like I gotta... I gotta be getting more souls. There's no way I can be only level 14 or some shit like that. This is crazy. And these crafting recipes I'm picking up, I ain't doing a thing. There's more balloons over there. That looks like a nice area to explore. I'll do that in a moment. Okay. It's a gigantic lobster. Why does everything got to be huge? Like... Like, come on, man. I won't be able to kill that thing. What if I just run past him? Yoink. Oh, the horse got hurt. Okay. Okay, 
him. He's chasing me. Was that worth it? It's just meat. I just picked up meat. Like, uh, I don't know. I was going to complain about something in this game, but I don't think it's worth complaining about with emotion. I think it's worth at least discussing to some degree. Uh, I made a comment before, why has everything got to be big? I mean, my statement still stands. Oh, here we go. They're going to see me any second now. Hello. <laughs> Alright. Let's try this. Oh, right, okay. That's handy. Let's try this then. Ah, oh, that's handy. Let's try this then. What the fuck am I supposed to do? Summons jellyfish. FP cost 31. What's my FP? 71. FP cost 28. Okay. Why can't I use it? Do I need like a staff or something? Why are they looking at me like that? Anyway. I'm going to attack him. If I die, it's, it's whatever. All right, come on. Next. To jump up there. Holy, they're fucking strong. Hey, look, you know, I apologize. I didn't know. Why is that one so much stronger than the last two? The last two went down in a couple of swings. That one just tanked them. Yeah, you walk away. Let me explore. Nice. How was that? Look at all the I <laughs> did that much damage. Okay, whatever, they ran away. Um That's fine, like that's a I mean I was just gonna talk about enemies just being so fucking large and that being an indicator of difficulty to some degree. I can't tell you how many giants or huge enemies I've walked past. Um, just because it's a big open world doesn't necessarily mean that things need to be huge. Like, it just do it doesn't have to be the case. You can have enemies placed in strategic areas or have unique things that you need to deal with to some degree. Like, for example, a pack of wolves splitting up the pack. I mean, they're still hard as fuck and I can't beat them, but that's a poor example, I guess, of what I was talking about. That gigantic, like, bear dog thing I thought was a gorilla guarding that piece of meat that I picked up before. That was a good example. Like, it didn't have to be this huge fucking enemy. Like, 
And the lobster as well. Like that big ass lobster I saw down there. That doesn't need to exist. And Dark Souls 3 had it as well. Only with the crabs though, I guess. I can't really. And there was a shitload of giants and like... So on and so forth. Can I see... I don't know. I don't know what's going on. I can't see any bloodstains. Oh, well, I mean, I can see the bloodstains. I can't see, like, how people died. Which I feel like is not a good thing. Because you sort of learn from other people's deaths. Like, if there's 20 bloodstains on the floor, I'm going to be like, hmm, well, what's going on over here? And then I'm going to watch the blood stain and... Okay, there's a thing in here. I'm going to watch the blood stain and be like, okay, well, now I know not to do that. Is that a fucking enemy? What is that? Oh, no, it looks like a tapestry or something. A, a, a painting? What is that? Okay. What's the point of that? I like this. And I'll find this painting. Oh wait, what does this do? Boost poison. Okay, uh, let's figure out this. But I don't... How do I use it? I don't need to use these to have an expansive repertoire of crafting. Alright, well, it's just a fucking painting. Where am I? Holy shit, why am I so... What's up here then? Maybe I'll go back here and then go this way, if possible. Maybe it isn't possible. I don't know. My, oh, I might go actually here. Oh, there's something here. I mean, I need to find out how to buy more arrows because I'm running critically low on arrows. I have five. Oh, yes, now I can level up my smithing stuff. I'll level up my, uh, rapier for sure. I should also purchase a club. Um, because, you know, skeletons, stone enemies, I think would probably... Might be beneficial to have a club for that. Cool. What's down there? And how do I get down there without breaking my ankles? Don't think I can. Jumping off ahead, likely death. Yeah, I would agree with you there. Another graveyard. I assume one of those skeletons are going to make an appearance. I don't know why I'm creeping. Oh, nice, a dragonfly head. I'm basically just using this horse to get away from enemies. Oh, oh cool, you can swipe on the left. Why didn't it tell us that? I feel like perhaps that's something that it should have instructed during the tutorial, unless I missed it. Alright, what is this? 
The dude rowing a boat. Okay. It's a mini boss. I don't know what he's doing though. Tibia Mariner or Marina. Mariner. Outstanding mini boss. Look at him. He's just gone up here. Swimming up there. I need some a whole bunch of skeletons or something. Fascinating. Well, I don't know if I'm equipped to deal with those just yet. There's a bridge here, though. So I'm going to put a marker there and head in that direction. Obviously circumnavigating the dude in the fucking canoe. Maybe it's my hesitancy to engage in uh, boss fights and so on and so forth. Or, well, I mean, it's the first mini boss I've ever seen. Well, okay, that's a lie. I, I've, I assume I've seen a couple. But that's the first one in which a health bar had appeared. And made it clear that it was a mini boss. I guess there was that dude at the very beginning on the horse. That I was like, nope. Death, don't you dare. Yeah, it does look like death, doesn't it? Although, I'd really love to go down there. I picked up an item. I assume it's a crafting item. Oh no. It was... The dragonfly head or whatever. Yeah, it must be a crafting item. Oh, there it is. Yeah. So is he supposed to be named after a, a bone in the human body, or is this supposed to be like an area? No, right now. I can't go there. It doesn't look like an... Oh, ooh, can I... I can make my way down there. Oh, wrong button. Does the horse take less damage? Oh, shit. Controlling this horse is not easy. Jarberg. Alright, get out of here. Leave! The fuck is that? I'm not going near that. Actually, I'll get the thingy. Wait, Jarberg. Oh, I get it. He's in a jar. His enemy's in a jar here. So, that's funny. Alright, well, I assume he can fight back. So I'm not even going to bother. Not yet. What do I... I mean, I don't know, maybe it's just me. I, I got no idea. But I just feel like no matter where I go or what I attack, I'll just be too weak to beat it or anything like that. Now, I know that's not necessarily the truth. Oh, I could have used that as one of my um, starting gifts. So what does that do? Uh, I think it was a crafting thing, wasn't it? Yeah, crafting cracked pot items. Poison bloom. Oh, please tell me I can make poison arrows with poison bloom. That'd be lovely. Oh my God, look how much stuff is here. Oh shit, Jaws. 
Well, that ghost is attacking him, so... There's nothing incredible ahead. Jarberg. <laughs> it's funny. I don't think I can backstab him or anything. Let's see how we go. Yikes, they got some health. Oh, uh, they don't do that much damage, actually. Oh. Are they hostile, actually? I don't know why I attacked him. Oh, man, I feel bad. They're not hostile. Wait, are they? No. No. I don't think they're hostile. Well, he's hostile. I think I stole his... His, I don't know, cousin or something. Living Jar Shard. He's gonna jump. And they attack fast. Swipe. Why does blood come out of him? Alright, here we go. He does the jump. Are there like dudes in the jar? Why like there's blood coming out of them when I kill them? Oh fuck, I'm not going for the big one. There's no way. I got a living jar shard. It's probably another crafting material here. It's like... You just pick up a lot of items. And if you ever have a question of, oh, what does this do? Don't even bother. Actually, there was a symbol on the left. Oh, that doesn't really tell you. Um, yeah, it seems like if you ever have a fucking question about what you pick up, like, what does it do, or... The answer is nothing. It's a crafting item. Now, I don't know whether or not I want to. Oh, he's not waking up. I lied, I lied, I lied. How do you wake up? <laughs> oh, well, I must say, I've picked up a lot of poison bloom, which I'm excited because there's got to be a recipe out there which basically says, hey, you can make poison arrows. Wait, bloom's in toxic terrain. Is this toxic? Hmm. I'm gonna get rid of this. <laughs> Jarberg. <laughs> Clever. Just gonna sort of maneuver around. Not especially fascinated in a. I don't mind working up. My bad. I apologize, good sir. I just wanted your flowers. Let me guess. Hidden wall. Let there be door. Okay, well that's... Oh, how do you get up there? Horse, I assume. Alright, so there really doesn't seem to be anything in Jarberg whatsoever. It just seems to be a whole bunch of jars and... I assume you'll need to keep coming back. 
uh, in order to collect those living jar fragments, which you'll probably need for quite a lot of crafting later on in the game. Of which I have found none of them. So I'm going to make my way up. Uh, can't get in any of those houses, so that's that. I came from up there, where the conveniently placed tombstones are. I haven't rested at the bonfire yet. But I will... Did I explore on the outside? I feel like I might have. No, I don't think I did. It's not a door. Maybe I should have rested. What's the worst that can happen? I die. There's a blood stain here though. So I guess in, it would have been nice to know what caused it. Ah, uh, no, that's death. For sure. How oh, well, Jarberg didn't have anything here. Just a whole bunch of jars and it doesn't really lead to anywhere. Or at least nowhere I've found yet. Uh, I got a lot of crafting materials from it, which is uh, good. I think I need to be the horse to jump back up, don't I? I know, I don't think I do. Alright, I <laughs> just... Cool. Alright, he falls back asleep. I can level up once, level up strength, and I think I might head to the table to, I'll pop one of these, which I'll pop two of them, because that should be 400 souls, right? Yeah. I'll head back to the round table. Like, where, where is this taking me? To the lake, maybe. Ooh, I might do that then. Going to go back to the table to level up my rapier and then I'll come back all right so round table uh is it this way that's edgelord no is it this way no it's this way then here well I took you for dinner I'm out lay out your arms four what do you mean what additional... I'm so lost. I don't understand. I thought I had four smithing stones. Do I not? Oh, wrong button. Wrong button. I... I... I'm... I'm lost. All right, so I need, oh, I need four smithing stone one. That's really fucking annoying how it doesn't, I don't think that's phrased very well at all. Uh, right, okay. Well, I just wasted my time and wasted your time. So that's fun. All right. Uh, I guess I'm going to head to here and then see if I can go this way. 